Oh, okay. Now we're talking. Like, there's an SCP in here. Is it this? Is it this blue mass? Blue mass and some black liquid. Is something gonna happen? Not me bald. <laughs> not me bald, but also not me bald wading through mysterious black liquid. Not me bald and waiting. Welcome to Self Scare, the gaming show where I play scary, spooky games. As you can see, um, this guy's here again. I still don't know his name. I don't really know how he gets into my house. Every October, he just kind of shows up. Really doesn't seem to understand basic social cues. And so I just kind of let him stay. He doesn't really do anything. You know, I lent him a t-shirt because usually he shows up naked. He shows up just like, just butt ass naked, just, well, less of a butt, more of a tailbone, tailbone, hip bone, pelvis uh, kind of situation that he shows up with. So I gave him something, I gave him a little something to cover up and uh, I'm gonna let him be in the video, you know, why not? So for this Halloween, I had an idea. I know that's rare. You may know I'm very into, um, I don't know what to call it, community created game platforms, like Dreams, like Roblox, like Super Mario Maker. It's just so fun to see what people make that are not necessarily following good game design principles. Anyway, so this Halloween, I thought we could check out some of these community-created games in the horror genre. And uh, since I am notoriously easily frightened, I thought we could start it off nice and easy with Roblox. Specifically, we're going to check out some SCP-themed Roblox games. I always wanted to play SCP Containment Breach back in the day when that was a thing a million years ago, but I'm a pussy. I'm a pussy, I'm pussy. So I never did. I need to shut the fuck up. Okay, so this one is SCP-3008, the infinite Ikea. So I guess like the SCP is an Ikea? So, I mean, if you don't know what SCP is, it's like a wiki of monsters, kind of, or like spooky. It's like spooky copy pasta type shit in wiki form. <laughs> there you go. That's the world's worst explanation of what SCP is from me to you. But usually it's like each article is like a monster or something, like a spooky, um, um, what's the word? Entity? The way this is worded is like, this SCP is an Ikea. Um, it says, build a base, survive from employees, stay alive. I can't promise you that any of that will happen. So the employees are, are my enemies, I guess? Am I gonna have to play with, <laughs> am I gonna have to play with other people? Are there like children in here? Are there children in here? That might be a problem for me. Day 69? Oh my God. This is a spooky ass Ikea. Wait, see, this is just fun. Like, it's just fun to like be in Ikea. It didn't give me any information. Balenciaga, slay. <gasps> Hot dogs and pizza on the ground. I don't know what's going on. I don't know my controls. Oh, I could, I could do single player. Should I be social? Should I talk to the children? The children are kind of scaring me already. I was trying to figure out if I- You guys, my heart failed. My heart just failed. That was so scary. I'm gathering that things are going to be chasing me now. I don't have a base. I don't have anything. Hello? Oh, he's moving. Is this a real enemy? <laughs> Not me being scared. It's Roblox. Should I follow the arrows? I'm just chilling. I'm just pretending I'm chilling. We're just like in Ikea after hours. It's just fun. It's just fun. This is fun. And I'm like having fun. You know, like you don't get to be in here after hours very, very much. It's like sleepover vibes. Pick up? Pick up what? Oh, hold to pick it up. Oh, this is what they mean. Oh, we're building bases with the Ikea furniture. Wait, that's kind of fun. Oh, that's cute as hell. So can I just like build a little box around myself and, and like, and, and just shit and piss in it? Oh my god, that's like the question humans have been asking since the dawn of civilization. Like, once upon a time there was a first human to go, can I just build a little box around myself and shit and piss in it? And that's when they made the first ever house. Am I supposed to be scared? Is there supposed to be guys after me? I have hunger. I have hunger and energy. That's what I say when lunchtime rolls around. I say, I have hunger. I'm just trying to find the other children at this point. Hello? Other children? I have a toilet to offer you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Excuse me, the store is now closed. Oh, they're just telling me the store is closed. He's just like being a good employee. He's just telling me to leave. He's just telling me to get the fuck out. He's like, I want to go home. I have a family. Look how cute my character is, though. 
Oh my god, what? Who put this picture of the rock here? So, is that as scary as it gets? <laughs> Can I start over? Don't forget to breathe, not at, not at knowing that I'm shitting myself right now. Can I, where was the game modes thing? I'm like, can I just be by myself? That sound is the scariest part of it. Whoa. Okay, so what if my base is right here? Can I pick up the walls? No. Cause like, let me make some walls around myself, right? Let me get this. Can I make this um vertical? I don't think I could rotate it vertically. Also, I've never heard music like this in an Ikea, if there's implying that this is like music you would hear in an Ikea. Anyway, um, what I'm doing is building my base, okay? To explain what I'm doing a little bit, for all you noobs that might not be aware, what I'm doing right now is building my base. Okay, the problem with this is that they'll just, those, those little employees, they're wily, okay? I've seen them. I've seen them in this game just now and I've seen them in real life, they're wily. They're just gonna jump right through. They're just gonna jump through these little beds, but I don't know what else to do really. Like I need tall things, I need walls. Oh my God, the help desk. I keep trying to double tap forward to run like in Minecraft. Oh, the axes, that's what that is. Oh, we have walls, we have walls because I figured it out. I really hope, you guys, I really hope that night doesn't come very fast. Oh my God, please, 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 please. Right, because I'm slaying. No, I'm slaying, I'm slaying, I'm slaying, I'm slaying. I keep losing where I am. Oh my God, the infinite Ikea, the infinite aspect of it. Should I have picked up the pizza and hot dogs? No, they can't weasel through there, right? That's too small. That's too small even for as wily as they are. They couldn't weasel through that, right? Oh my god, I'm slaying. I'm slaying. Could they jump? I'm scared of night coming just because of the sound it makes. Should I just sit in here? Oh my god, I can climb up this bunk bed to get in my house. Oh, it's genius. It's genius. They'll never get me in here. I'm really into the, the hanging posters that just go up into infinity. It's giving the infinite vibe. Um, shit. It's so scary. It's so scary. And, and guess what, guys? If they can come in here, I'm just... They won't know I'm in here though, cause I'm like hiding. So like, I'm seeing what's happening, right? Like we're in Ikea, we want to stay the night. I'm like, let me just put a bunch of pallets up and like hide so they don't know I'm in here and I can just stay the night casually. Okay, this is like w w when all those YouTubers were doing um like 24 hours in Walmart challenge. They were like making forts out of toilet paper to like s to sleep in Walmart. Some things I say I've observed on the internet sound even to me like I must've made that up. They're never gonna find me, right? I can just sit here. I can just sit here and have a little chat. What does the fall is coming mean because that's freaking me out i'm for sure imagining that i'm seeing things moving around in the in the slats is there a youtuber in there no because now i'm remembering what i'm thinking of i think gabby de martino did that i think gabby de martino made a four out of toilet paper in a walmart look at the camera focusing there's like some advanced graphics in this. Is that someone standing right there? I feel like maybe I slayed this too hard. They're never gonna find me in, in this video. Is, there's nothing's gonna happen in this video. This is realistically what I would, I would be doing in any actual horror scenario, standing in the corner, zooming in with my eyes, just being terrified for my life. But they're never gonna find me. I built too good of a fort. Like the whole point of this game is building forts and I built the, the best possible fort instantly. This is boring, right? I have to leave. We're just hanging out doing YouTube challenge. Nothing's even happening. Oh my God, this little outdoor section. This place has things Ikea doesn't even have. There's stuff going on in here that's not even going on in Ikea in real life. Bruh. So this is it? Oh my God, is that food? Not the Ben and Jerry's and the Dr. Bob? Store. Oh, oh, I can just pick it up. I can just pick it up to have. Oh my God, my diet is horrible. Soda and ice cream only? Yeah, you know, I feel like this is how I feel about most Roblox games is at a certain point I go, this is it? <laughs> At a certain point I say, this is it? I'm leaving. But unfortunately, I'm leaving that one. This is another, this is another SCP one. The chaos ensuing right now instantly. What is happening? Who is he? This is more in line with like what I was looking for, I think, to be honest. I'm not sure um, whatsoever why I'm bald like this. It's so loud. What in the world is going on? Whoa, okay. I had a much cuter outfit going on. I just did a little stream putting the outfit on and anyone that was there could tell you I was swagified beyond my wildest dreams. I don't know why I look like this now. And I didn't just have the, the, the Homer Simpson single strand of hair on top of my head like this. So the real horror is that I have to, I have to look this ugly in whatever, whatever is going on. What is happening? This is the kind of chaos that I love from Roblox though, right? Because like, what is going on? These guys have guns, I don't have that. No teeth? Where did you get, how do you get a gun? Can I go out? Who is he?
Oh my god, he's positively chasing that little pink girl into hell. He's positively chasing her into hell. I cannot get over how I look right now. I never wanted to be hideous. Story of my life. Hi, are you dangerous? Is this supposed to be a scary design for a thing? The music? There's like scary music. Ha Am I supposed to be scared of him? It's not giving scary to me. My sprint isn't working by the way, but I don't really need- I'm, we're kind of just walking along at a leisurely pace together. I don't really even need the sprint. <laughs> Can I close the door? Are you gonna get through? No, you're not. No, you're not, little man. Nice try. Oh, he wants me so desperately and he simply can't have me. I got away, I think. I think I got away. My bald head with these headphones on. But this is what I'm talking about, the level of quality of Roblox games. First of all, extremely variable. Whoa. What is going on in here? And I just love that people make games on here that are not even games. Like, what is this? What's my goal? Where am I going? It really gives the same vibe as kids playing with toys, right? Because there's no, there's no actual game rules. It doesn't actually make any sense. They just like put a bunch of stuff in here and called it a game. But there's something actually sick about that. Sick in a good way. Sick and twisted. Sick and twisted in a good way. What are all these doors? Ooh, there's like little dorms. It's like you could role play in here, you know? There's like little dorms. For, for what? For the SCP scientists? Oh my god, Butterfly Man is out here. Did the door open back up? Is he even gonna hurt- is he, is he even gonna hurt me? Oh, he is- he is- <laughs> He did slowly kill me by standing on my head. Are any of these scary? Can I go find the one that stands in the corner? I'm in the elevator? Is it moving? Oh my god. What's in the pit? Can I jump in the pit? Like, I probably shouldn't jump in the pit, right? Oh, okay, now we're talking. Like, there's an SCP in here. Is it this? Is it this blue mass? Blue mass and some black liquid? Is something gonna happen? Not me bald. <laughs> Not me bald, but also not me bald wading through mysterious black liquid. Not me bald and waiting. Oh, this one says it's safe. This one's safe. So I think we're good. Skull? Oh my god, you look just like my bestie. Oh, is this bad? Oh, it's slowly killing me. It's slowly killing me. I'm suffocating. Oh, but I look so good. I look so good. Nose job? Contour? Oh, beauty is pain. Beauty is pain. Okay, where can I go before I die? Where can I go? Oh. Hmm. This guy again. This guy's just annoying. He's so loud. See, this guy This guy has the default hair, okay? This is what I wanted to avoid by making my character cute, except it didn't even work, is I wanted to avoid looking like the default guy, because that's like, that's like lame, right? That's like noob territory. What is this? Whoa. Yellow. It's giving yellow. What is this? Oh, I can use these things. Wait, what, what happens if I use the boombox? I just look swaggy? Me with headphones on and carrying a boombox next to my ear? Nothing can scare me now with my flashlight, with my- Cause this is what a flashlight looks like. Who is this? Who is this? Oh, is this the guy? Are you the guy? Excuse me, are you the guy? Whoa! Can he not get me next to the wall? Is he too big? I think he's too big to reach me next to the wall. Yeah, cause he can reach me out here, but not when I'm next to a wall. Simply stand next to the wall and he's thwarted easily, not tails! <laughs> Tails being huge, not tails being huge. So we've reached an understanding, I think, me and him. I think me and him have reached an understanding of some kind. Oh my God, can I try a different one? Okay, this is the guy I was talking about. This is the guy that stands in the corner. This is the one that's gonna make me shit. Oh my God. <laughs> can I shut the fuck up? Why did I scream? So the thing is you have to look at him. Willow staring at me. The thing is you have to, somebody has to be looking at him because if nobody is looking at him, I think is when he can move and he's like extremely violent. This is like the one everybody knows about, I feel like. The sound effects are killing me. See, I looked away, I looked away and he got my ass. So what do we do about it? Where does he start, in here? Yeah, he's up there. Okay, I get it. But he starts in that gray room, I think. I think I remember this from, from seeing Let's Plays of Containment Breach. Can you stop? Okay. I love the little pumpkins. That's very cute. That's very cute Halloween decorations. Oh my god, you jump scared me.
None of these kids will speak to me. Oh my god, this looks like the Death Star. Oh, see, he's out. He's out now. Did we just let him out? Is everybody mashing the buttons? What's going on here? Can we cooperate? Can I freaking find some kids that will talk to me? Oh my god, this is the annoying one. This is the annoying one that was being loud. He was really harshing my vibe. Oh my god. Why? I don't show up with my clothes in any of these. The way I'm running? Uh, <laughs> is it him that's screaming? Is it the monster that's screaming? Oh, it's him screaming. Oh my god, he's like in distress. He's like not having a good time. <laughs> he's the fastest motherfucker alive! How fast he was disappearing around those corners! Yeah, I think I've had enough. None of that was really giving scary. Unfortunately, none of that was really giving scary. I think the children making Roblox games, in fact, don't know what horror is. I think maybe they haven't experienced enough horror in their real life to like, to really understand. I think we need to wait until they're, they've reached adulthood and, they, and they're a little bit more traumatized and then maybe they can try again. Cause like, what do you think? Damn, I can't, I can't even repeat what this guy's saying. Yeah, okay, okay, I'm gonna have to cut him off. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Some goldfish? Oh. I actually don't know where those went. I think they went into the shirt. Oh my god. <laughs> those things went right through him. <laughs>